everybody, it's me Jason and welcome back to your favorite channel Rainbow's Mood. Today we will recommend some gay movies that will make us smile happily at the end of the movie. According to your most requests, happy ending films have become the favorite of many people. This can be a reference for you to watch when you are with partners, friends, and also family. Say goodbye to movies with sad endings. Press like and subscribe because there will be many other best videos until next year. Let's start with the first movie. That was incredible. <laughs> Thanks. I... The first movie is Geography Club. This movie is based on the best-selling novel by Brent Hardinger's. This movie tells the story of a 16-year-old teenager named Russell, who is in the phase of questioning his sexuality. He is close to a woman named Trish, but on the other hand, he likes his handsome teammate named Kevin. Russell needed a place to speak his heart out, so he joined the Geography Club. They made friends with other gays and also a lesbian couple. Will Russell and Kevin ever get together? Or do they have to choose their own direction? Tell us how you think about this movie in the comments. I was persecuted daily. Next, there is a movie about friendship called Handsome Devil, which was released in 2016. Ned is an openly gay teenager who has to give himself up to be shoved into a rugby-obsessed boarding school by his widowed father. There he lives in the hostel and has a tall and handsome rawmate named Connor who is also a rugby player. They both have different problems faced. Friendship drama in adolescence can be a fun spectacle to be enjoyed. There is nothing romantic in this film, but the nuances of friendship are the priority. Dat zijn flikkers of niet? Flikkertje, flikkertje, flikkertje. Oh. Ah. Ah. The fuck is er mis met jou, gast? The third is a gay romantic comedy film titled Just Friend, which was released in 2018. Joris is a teenager who likes motorbikes. He has a mother who is addicted to plastic surgery. On the other hand, there is Yad. He works at Joris' grandmother's house as a domestic help. There they met and fell in love just like soulmates. Sweet story, passion, laughter, and tears in this film. Joris and Yad have to work things out with their respective mothers first. This film is in Dutch, so make sure to turn on the subtitles. Matias, <laughs> tanto tiempo. Next, we have a film from Brazil with the romantic drama genre called Asteros. Tells the story of childhood friends who are reunited by fate. Little Matias had to go with his father because he was stranded in a relationship. More than 10 years later, Matias returns to his hometown because of a carnival event. Unfortunately, he brought his girlfriend, where he met Geronimo. When they meet again, those feelings re-emerge from childhood friendship into growing seeds of love. This film has a simple plot, but with lots of life lessons in it. Und das ist meine Familie. Glass, meine Mom, meine Sister, ja. Und das sind andere Familien. Und ihre Leben, an die sich Glass unter gar keinen Umständen anpassen will. Then there is a German language film based on the novel. Center of My World tells the story of trial and error in young relationships, friendships, family, and all the things that shape our character when we are young. Kleinfeld returned from summer camp. There is a new student in his class, he is handsome, named Nicholas. Klein instantly fell in love with him. Phil and Nicholas end up close and in love. But there is a lot of youth drama that occurs in this film. You can watch this cute film by subscribing to Amazon Prime. Check the link in the video description. Have you been a ride? Have you? Next, there is a film released in 1987 called Morris. 
This film has a complicated plot and beautiful scenery. It tells the story of two gay students who meet and fall in love in Cambridge. Morris and Clive had to experience ups and downs in their love story, because at that time homosexuality was very taboo. They both have to live the relationship quietly. Until finally Clive had to leave Morris and married a woman named Anne. Have you watched this film? Tell us what you think. Write a comment. This is going to be so cool. Summer jobs are a blast. We are going to have the summer of our lives. Another classic film released in 1998. A gay young man named Eric gets a summer job at a restaurant. There is Maggie's best friend there, lesbian manager named Angie, and a mysterious blonde man who make him fall in love. His name is Rod. They spend a lot of time together. Instead, secretly his best friend, Maggie, turns out to like Eric. This film carries a youth drama about love that is gray and unclear. Does anyone like gay films of this genre? Let us know in the comments. What if I just want to be the same old me that I was before? I'm Morgan. Dean. The eighth film is titled Morgan. A man named Morgan returns after a bicycle racing accident that robs him of his strength and paralyzes his legs. But he still tries to get up and be positive. Sometimes he also wants to give up and end his life. One day on the basketball court, he met a man named Dean. The two became friends until there was a feeling of love present. Dean brings positive energy to Morgan, but Morgan's ego and willpower sometimes worry Dean. When I look back on my sophomore year in high school, I was, well, a uniquely tragic wreck. Tells the story of a confident gay student named Chance Marcus. He recalled the incident when he was in international high school. He wants to make friends with many people, but not infrequently he is also bullied by the jocks at his school. Chance's self-confidence makes him appear at the drag club, but unexpectedly, photos of him performing are scattered around his school. This is where he knows where his real friends are. Cody. You're my dad. No, Cody. I'm your uncle. No, I'm my dad. This last film is very famous. Maybe all most of you have watched this film, Shelter. Zatch has to take care of his sister's kids and give up pursuing his art school dreams. He has a friend named Gabe the Rich. One day, Gabe's brother returns to their house. His name was Sean, and then he met Zach. Zach is in love with Gabe's brother, but he must stay focused on his main goal, namely his family who really need him. One of the best films in 2007. What do you think? Tell us in the comments. And those are 10 happy ending gay movies that can be a reference to watch with partners, friends, and also family. Tell us which is your favorite film on the list. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.